Jamaica Carnival, the place where all the wildness is let loose as we take to the streets soaking up the sun and the girls them revealing all of them body jar, amongst other body parts. Some clearly a little bit more confident than others. Alright, we're live, we're live. Yeah, we're live. Yeah, man, we're live. So, yeah. Just reach at the. What the place name? Just reach at the Vano. See what I mean? I don't know today at the Big Bad Jamaica Carnival. I'll be representing views. One bag of people there, brother. And you don't know where they from. Like a whole lot of people are meet up right there. This event is anticipated every year as the biggest modest way to end the carnival season. People come out in droves, like they never really have nothing to do. Like myself, yeah. There's multiple bands you could go with. This year I went to Exodus. Well, technically I was working. I was working with Views, which is a vape company. This video, however, will cover just two perspectives. Mine, which was from Exodus, and Yardmas, which was where my brother jumped. Naturally, we're going to start with, with where it all began. So, back in 1995, a woman decided that she was going to breed. Huh? <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold, hold, hold up. Not that far back. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Anyway, fast forward in 28 years, we reached on the ground over Devon House, which was where we did supposed to link up with the rest of the Views team to get ourselves prepared. As a bunch of vibes, man, naturally, we some tomfoolery did a go on before we headed out on the road. Alright, guys, so we are doing carnival practice right now. A practice yeah. all for one in the girl, then yeah. coming, ready, let's go. Ready. Yes, yes, yes. Faster, 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 two jokes. Chuk, 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 chuk. 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 And keep in mind while all, all of this are going hungry I kill me. So after we don't practice over wine and girl them and thing and re and day, just take some books and get ready for jump out. Meanwhile over yard mass they were doing their own preparations. Unlike us, they actually had breakfast. So none of them not hungry. And more importantly, them have shade. The rest of us out here in the sun like oh, oh, oh be man. We never like that. But anyways, the time come and the truck them jump out and the carnival road march officially started. So we're on the road, a wine girl from left to right, under the rope, over the rope, even upon the people them truck side. Checking in over Gen X, not many people were really there on the road as yet, because it is kind of early. Checking in with my brother over by Yard Mass, it was a completely different story. As you can see, the road ramped from the start. And, wait, wait. Pum pum, they're a little bit too close to it, tap them a boss. You know, fun do thing. So, anyways, beer vibes, ladies looking sexy, people enjoying themselves, doing all sorts of madness. One some, two some, three some, even wall some. Speaking of wall, apparently the Gen X people them like wall as well because, meanwhile, by Gen X, this was happening. But we can all come to the agreement that Yard Mass won the wall competition. My brother, the shirt disappear. I Try it on the road either. Yeah, well, just don't do it, none at all. Zin, at this point, I take a little detour from the people at work and decided that I'm going to find my friend who was by the top of the Is the vibes? Vibes is a thing where really infectious. Look how the man did just over the normal, and look how the dog jump now. <laughs> All right. All right. So this is one a zip truck. This, this is the old man truck. No music, no play. No girl getting breed. What did you say, nigga? No, none at all. None at all. This can't work. Eh, eh. I forgot breed. 
them. Yep, but after we breed them, I'm still going to breed them. Oh, yeah, leave it. Bro, I'm going to give you the word. See that? Turn around, the people are telling you to speak God. Well, if you show me you can't read, I don't know where to put the paper. And they don't know as per usual, you know, I end up running in pants before they come by, girl. You know, you don't know the thing, girl. Mm -hmm. Sooner than sooner rather than later, the clock touched 12 and at lunchtime. So I made my way back to the tent to go collect food. Alright guys, so you don't know lunchtime. You get Popeyes. I really never want Popeyes, but it's after the work, I'm hungry. Oh, hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? All of these are my aunts and family. Yeah. This is where oh, it's the car, you man. Hi, I didn't know about this. I'm going to go to the car. I'm going to go to the car. Huh? Huh? Is it possible you can spoil her with a chair? That's good. As a gentleman. Okay, I will, I will oblige. Thank you so much. Just go and eat it. Huh? Just go and eat it. Okay, alright. Okay, you see guys, get your man like. First time quickly came and passed, it was time to head back on the road. Over by Yardmas, the food depleted very quickly, leaving patrons waiting in line with nothing but the hope that more will return. So at this moment in time, all the food is done at every single section. There's no lunch people just in a line for no reason. And then the truck just pull up with the next set of food. Please don't make no sense, but this should have been a long time. This time I decided that I am going to find my brother who was over by the Admas truck, which was good little distance from where we did it. So we traversed back through the crowd after I find him, and so me decided to bring them back down my truck. I remember said me upon the clock, so you know, I feel like go back to Ushpa, me did it. On the way back, I found my virgin who was by Gen X. Eventually, everybody had to disperse and I made my way back to the top of my truck because my foot them did tired. Only to hear like five minutes after that we are going to have to walk, go back to Devon House. On my way there, I saw bikes, a lot of people were footing it as well. However, at this point, most if not all of us was really tired, so like, vibes it really dead. People just did one press. Alright guys, so, I done the carnival done, you know? So I make way over that guy the house, because we don't know, so we don't got money yard, you know, we don't got money yard, so we don't got no different house most here. But yeah, we are going over that guy's place, go see if we can pay the money. We are going over that place, yeah, over here, so, go see if we can get some food. Yeah, man. And then I don't know the after party is at the Soka Jam. They had a little after party after the road march ended. I didn't get much footage of each, but yeah, it was really hard to find. And there was also this which happened by Campari. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so that did happen. <laughs> we don't know why the brother brush him knows though, but anyways, after everything done, we went to Afrosoka Jam, the carnival after party, where it was more of the same, shaking, shaking off the room, jumping up and down, dancing, you know, the usual pet vibes. They, they actually had free massages and free drinks as well, so that was something a little different. At the end of the day, Carnival was a big vibe. I lost my voice, 
I got some serious sunburn, which I am recovering even right now. It was definitely worth it. I didn't wake up until about two days after. Would I do it again? Definitely. Next year, I'm definitely jumping with the atmosphere. So, you don't know. Make sure you like the video, share. Which band you know that I jump with? Leave a comment down below.